Hope y'all are. Cause you ain't got no choice. <laughs> Let's get into it. Yes, sir. I don't know why I did that at the end, but whatever. Okay, let's get to it, man. The Jimmy High Roller video. Oh, man. Kevin Garnett. Love KG, boy. <laughs> KG always keep it real. Mm. Mm. Listen, I said it before, bro. Uh, fell on the court basketball court today and got bruised. What the hell, Chris? You fell? Uh, 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 using the concrete or hardwood? Hmm, well, that's that sucks. Hope ho hope that gets healed up, my brother. Uh, Kevin Durant said that was a my career type performance from looking tonight. Some video get yeah, nah, 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 nah. nah. Life. I was gonna post a different video today. Facts. Had the whole thing planned out and ready to go. It was gonna be awesome. And then this happened. Yeah. Luka Doncic just had one of the greatest games. The only in one NBA in history. history is insane, bro. I love Jimmy's intros. Today's oh. video is sponsored by Oh, Audible. you gotta stop playing on concrete, you're at bro. Work, at the gym, maybe you're Telling in the you, car bro. Or just getting things done around the house. Get with... your money, Jimmy. I'm good. Of the greatest games in modern NBA history dating all the way back to 1979, according to Game Score. Game Score is a stat that uses all of the data from a given box score to measure a player's productivity and impact for a single game. Generally speaking, a game score of 10 is an average performance by an average I player. Up, Chris. A game score I of 20 <laughs> is considered a good game even from good players. A Damn. score of 30 is really starting to get into uncommon territory. Think all NBA level player on a very productive dog dirt. Throughout Kyrie, an entire okay. NBA season, there's usually less than 50 games that exceed a game score of 40. Think best game of the season from a superstar. And once we creep into games that have exceeded a game score of 50, we are entering a territory that only a handful of players in NBA history have ever accomplished. Stephen Curry okay. has never had a single game in his entire career that yielded him a game score this high. Neither has Kevin Durant. LeBron has only done it once in his entire NBA career, and so has Giannis. And Michael Jordan accomplished but, this feat more than any other player with four. But the thing is, too, about, like, I just want to say about, about Steph's situation. It's funny because I'm not trying to take away from Luca's greatness, but it's just always funny because whenever I talk to my friends about it, just anybody in general, they, general, they always say, man, we, we really wish Steve Curry would have let Curry loose those times instead of pulling him in early or even now at times when he pulls him in early where he could go for freaking 60 plus sometimes, man. It's just a shame, man. But to see Luca, like I said, bro, to see Luca just – Ball how he's balling, trying his hardest to build the chemistry, trying his hardest to get teams set up, you know, like Reggie's bum ass. And, um, you know, it's 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 frustrating, bro, because he and Hardaway are the only ones that I'm seeing that look as if uh they're frustrated when they lose. Like they're not just like, oh, oh, well, they're actually frustrated. You know, uh, Chris said, uh, bro, but we only got like one indoor court in the whole country jeez where do you live bro jesus christ where you <laughs> where do you live <laughs> four of these games throughout his entire career well, but at the very top of the list are the 10 best games in modern basketball history according to game score lucas game against oh jimmy that commercial right there is crazy animals. it's a squirrel <laughs> You don't need to get that person. Listen, thank thank God gamers not in here to cut my ass right now. Affordable price. We're still um, dealing with these neighbor, commercials. <laughs> State Farm is there. Call or click to get a quote today. Yo, we don't care. I'm actually happy to see this. I'm happy to see this movie. Yo, if y'all ever played the game, yo. It's the Knicks on two. Totally off topic. But if y'all ever played that game, I think it was Beast Wars. Uh, bro, when I saw this movie. 11. Okay, 11. Six, seven. Oh, wow. What really? Only one court indoor? Wow, dog. That's. I'm sorry. Jesus Christ. Um, yo, you ever played Beast Wars, bro? To 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 see this now being part of the uh, Transformers universe with Beast Wars, bro. I felt like a kid again. It, it was insane seeing this this uh, uh uh trailer. It was insane, bro. It was Tuesday insane. night earned him a game score of fifty six point three. 
the fifth best single game performance ever. 60 points, 21 rebounds, and 10 assists. Only the second 60 point triple Damn, double four, in Jesus NBA Christ. history. This is the best regular season performance I have ever seen live with my own two eyes. Because if Luka's record-breaking stat line wasn't historic enough, the kid put up these numbers while pulling off an almost impossible Yo, that was hilarious. Comeback. He did that, I was with crying. just 33 seconds left in the fourth quarter, the Mavericks were down by nine points. At this point, 99% of teams will just concede and call it a game. In fact, throughout the last 20 years, there have been 13,800... Carlos, what did you just say? The top game score is when Michael Jordan had a stat line of 69 points, 18 rebounds, 6 assists, and 4 steals in one block. I mean, yeah, I mean, yeah. That, I mean, but what do you think is more impressive? Do you think that's more impressive or do you think the, the stat line Luka had was more impressive? What do you think? What do you think and tell me why? Everybody, tell me why. Uh, Yeah, every, every other court is outdoor. Bro, so then let me ask you this. uh, Chris, there's not a lot of them. Um, The weather down there, like... Yeah, I mean down there, yeah. But uh, like, how is it? Like, is it is it is it good enough for y'all to be able to hoop consistently outside like that, or no? 184 teams that were down at least nine points with 35 seconds or less remaining. Prior to Tuesday night, here's a list of the teams that pulled off a comeback in these games. None of them. Oh my Not god! <laughs> yo, 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 Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy's an asshole. Yo, he got me. I'm not gonna cap. He got me. One team that was in good. the last two decades good, has that pulled good. off a comeback of this magnitude until Luca and the Mavs did it. After going on a 6-3 run in just 29 seconds of game time, Luca found himself at the line with just Dog four seconds open, left bro. on the clock. He sinks the first free throw, but they're still down two. So now Luca's got to pull off a miracle. Their only shot at winning this game would mean Luca would have to intentionally miss a free throw. I mean, Lucky, what's up, bro? I mean, you took 23. Free throws, he still had a crazy stat line, regardless. I mean, he's also the second in the league at, at um uh, uh what do you call it? Free throws uh attempted. Also, too, you have to put this into perspective too, uh Lucky Elo. Um his team is trash. His team is absolutely caca. So I don't I actually don't mind too much of him honestly getting too many free throws. I actually don't mind. Uh, I think the Lucas style line is more impressive because of the history and the circumstance of the game. They were down nine with 35 seconds. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true. That's freaking true. Wow. But yeah, man, like I, I, I it's crazy because I'm like I'm like when I watch Luca play, right? I said this before. When I see Reggie Bullock sit there and be just just trash in a consistent, impressive basis, and then I say Bertans doing a copycat of the same thing and other players at times too but they're just way more consistent of being trash uh not trash but i'm sorry I'm sorry not being consistent i apologize okay there we go um it's just weird uh injuries to finney smith and uh, uh cleaver were a huge hit to them bullock is <laughs> yo slobber <laughs> yo bro bro i don't yo bullock was actually hooping on the knicks i don't know what happened uh and can't forget about Josh. No, Josh Green is nice. I'm not worried about Josh. Josh is going to be filthy. I have no doubt in my mind he's going to consistently be. Uh, yo, like I said, when you see those players that love to play with a chip on their shoulder, bro, it is absolutely a sight to see. I love seeing these so-called no-names making names for themselves. I love seeing that, bro. And when I see dudes like Green, like even when they played this Golden State, bro, and I saw Green stripping a, a pool one time, I was low-key like, yo, dog is nice. <laughs> like, for real, dog is nice, you know? Uh, Chris also said... We, we well, we only got go got like rain and sun and heavy rain seasons in May, June, and November, December. And when those times come, it'll be weeks straight of rain and flood. Ooh, flooding! So does it get cold, cold there? Like, does it get to the point of it's like uh, below thirty, for example? Beat five bodies to the ball and somehow hit a shot in four seconds. It shocks me about this game. And that drew this this was so like, I, if you haven't seen this video of me reacting to this this game, please do because this was. The best reaction I could have gave for this shot. And that's exactly what he did. Bro. I was so like So impressed. Uh, yo, also, I I'm playing I'm playing this game too. Uh for, for sake. 
I forgot what's called. But I'm playing it too. Comeback. <laughs> Paired with this game tying shot is a highlight that most players could only dream of pulling off. And not only did Luka do it, this was his 54th point of the game. Luka Doncic definitely agree, Carlos. Definitely agree, bro. Unbelievable. Definitely. And right when you think you've seen everything the kid can do on a basketball court, he gives us this historic performance. And Chris, I hope you drown in a puddle. Seventy-eight degrees is the low. I just I don't want to be up here anymore, bro. I love the heat. <laughs> oh, bro, I be having wet dreams, dog, of just like having nice weather all the time, bro. Y'all gonna think that's weird? I don't care. Oh my goodness, bro. I don't care. I just don't care, bro. Oh God, here he is. Oh God, here's guy. Hi, Carson. Quite possibly the craziest part about all of this, the kid is only 23 years old. Here's a chart of the greatest Not going games back to the beginning. all time You're late. NBA greats before You're they late. turn 24. Towards the bottom, we've got Garnett, Dirk, and Iverson. As we make our way up, you'll see Steph, Westbrook, and CP3. Keep mm -hmm. going up, and you'll find that the greatest players of all time Chris, I'm start, I'm start the really vote good. already. Giannis, Harden, and LeBron all had similarly great oh games before God, they turned 24. And at the very top is Nikola Jokic, Kobe Bryant, and Shaquille O'Neal. Three of the best games we've ever seen from young players. And then there's Luka, who put together a game so good it doesn't Carson, you have three more times or you are going to go <laughs> yo Carlos don't 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 yo Diz what's up bro oh man yo listen you missed a lot bro last time you saw me we, we, I was at what 200 uh, uh subs look at us now dog look at us now strong girthy pause uh Yo, this dude loves the magic. Jesus Christ. If I don't know, uh, Dizzy E's one of my, my I met him in, through uh, uh, video games a long time ago. And then we have a whole group that's just cool as hell, bro. And one day we we, we going to all kick it together. Uh, this guy calls me Playboy. <laughs> Yo, listen, Chris, Chris, don't worry about it. He's, 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 he's like 10. So even look like it belongs on this chart. Yes, sir, bro. This yes, kid sir. Is something else. We got that 10K plaque next year. Performance, he is now averaging. Are you ready for this? All right, 34, Carson. 9, and 9 a game on 62% true shooting percent. That's insane. That is absolutely insane, dog. And people really hate on him. Like, I... I These numbers don't even make sense. So then you're if a bandwagon. Any better, I'd think they Get were a typo. Him. In fact, if you told me six years ago when I started covering the NBA that a 23-year-old would be putting up these numbers in 2022, I'd ask if we invented time machines and we somehow managed to go back to 1980. Fourth 50.20 triple double. What? Yo. I'm, yo. I'm telling you, man. Happy New Year's, bro. New Year's Eve is tomorrow. Happy, happy New Year's, Curse. 87 and transport a young Michael Jordan into today's NBA. If you showed me this box score without any context, I'd literally. Oh, yo, this, yo, tell Ho that I said the Pacers look player of all time. beautiful. And then this if you year, told me the, the same guy who piled up these numbers also but pulled off this. one of the. I don't think y'all understand how hard that shot is. Ball player of all time. And then if you told me the same guy who piled up these numbers also look at pulled this. off one of the greatest comebacks in nba history in oh the same game God. i wouldn't hesitate to call you a liar it's just not possible what is this 2k no it's just luka Doncic. in fact they out of show every the other player three, in every game since the inception of the nba oh, luka is the only I mean, player I to achieve a 60 20 10 game truly Halliburton a Wilson unicorn Brew. of a performance oh hmm Halliburton. You can't say that just yet because there's still enough time for like just for an example for uh I don't even know honestly. I don't know. I don't know. He actually might be most improved. He, I ain't gonna lie. Unless Jordan Poole starts scoring like 25 to 30 a game, then that's different, but consistently. But uh Hal Burton, yo, he's nice, bro. They're fun to watch. Check out that Nemhard dunk. Nah, nah, I saw that. I saw that. I saw that, bro. I I was Yo, Hi, ha Halliburton, yo, listen, his jump shot looks like he, he he's lagging on 2K, but my goodness, bro, does he, he, his IQ was phenomenal.
His IQ is absolutely phenomenal. And his, and his touch around the rim is beautiful, as well as his jump shot being consistent from the base to the tip of the shooting point. Pause. I know y'all got to say something. Uh, it's, it's just really nice to see that. He is getting to get off that draw. Hey, you don't know that, bro. Let's draw pool starts going from 25 to 30. That's it. That's it. You know? <laughs> and then and then Golden State get up, too, in the West. It's, it's over. You know? But uh, uh, Halliburton right now, though, I mean, there's other players that possibly could. Uh, De'Aaron, no, nah, I don't think D. Fox could get it, actually. No, nah, he couldn't. He couldn't. He couldn't. He couldn't. Uh, but, I mean, if I was to put my, put my money on it, I'll, I'll say Halliburton right now, definitely, too. I, I hope no, no, none of them get hurt. I, like for the ones that are really like working to get that uh, uh any award, I hope I hope you hope, hope they don't get hurt, bro. Cause how mm. ain't no pitter patter. Cause, cause yeah, listen, if he get knock knock on wood, he gets hurt, then what? You know, performance. In fact, if we add up all of Lucas' counting stats, points, rebounds, assists, steals, and blocks, his performance adds up to a whopping. 94. To put this almost unbelievable total into perspective, here's a list of the most productive games in modern NBA history dating back to 1979. Okay, Just to even crack this list, a player needs to have a counting stat total that exceeds 71. That means a player can put up a 50-point yeah. triple-double That'd be so not weird, even make though. this list. You'll see a lot of James Harden on Russell, Russell, a lot of Russell Westbrook so and Michael weird. Jordan. Among big men, could. you'll find Joel Embiid a few times, Anthony Davis, Hakeem, DeMarcus Cousins, and others. But despite the tens of thousands of games that have been played over the last 43 seasons, only 24 individual performances exceeded a total of 80. And at the very top, right behind the best statistical game of Michael Jordan's entire career Luca's really is Luka's Masters. Oh, it's right behind. Oh, the oh, second I'm biggest sure. game in modern NBA history. And the best game I have ever seen with my own eyes. Turns it into an asterisk year for whoever gets it then. I'm tired as hell. I mean. <laughs> I need a recovery beer. I mean, injury. Yo, Luka's stupid. I mean, injuries are part of the game. That's why I like, for example, like I never make excuses for like when Golden State lost those years when they were in, when they had injuries. I'll make an excuse. Injuries are part of the game. It happens. Like, you know, if I sit there and, and say, oh, we're, like, I feel like I'll, I'll be diminishing a lot of people's championships or, and everything like that just because that's part of the game. Like, that's part of the game, bro. As sad as it is, it is what it is. But great video by Jimmy, though, per usual, man. Give that brother a like, please. If y'all don't know about Jimmy High Roller, please. Luca was doing some good in that game. What are you? What are you talking about, Kirsten? What the hell are you talking? I hate you. 